Hi there. I hope that you are doing absolutely amazing today. I hope you're feeling extremely abundant and experiencing high levels of peace. I am Tanya Wilson, Master Life and Business Coach, also known as The Growth Strategist. I am a life and business coach helping women just like you to tap into their personal power. Uh, create businesses and lifestyles that they absolutely love all while making a lot of money. <laughs> and today I want to talk about a download I got this morning. Simply as I was opening my eyes, you know, one of the things I do before I fully get out of bed is I say a meditative type prayer and um, just start allowing my thoughts to um, flow into my day instead of having this abrupt, you know, hurry up and get out of the bed uh, type moment. And oftentimes, if I'm mindful, I'll hear a particular word or a phrase that I remember that resonates with me and this morning, it was, well, when you hear this, it won't be this morning, but the day that I recorded this for you, <laughs> this morning, it was the word evolve. And so expansion, reinvention, evolution, growth, each of those words hit home for me every time I hear them, say them, or write them. And when I look back at patterns in my own brand, about every four years, I renew my, my brand uh, because of expansion, reinvention, evolution, and or growth. Not to be confused with rebranding. Now, we are going to talk about rebranding on today, but we're going to talk about renewing your brand and rebranding your life. I'm going to say that again, renewing your brand as it relates to what you do in the marketplace, how you serve, the work that you do, how people get to experience your gifts through your business, renewing your brand and rebranding your life. And so first, I want to start with um, a definition, right? Let's start with the definition for renew. Now, you got to know that this is a, a beautiful word. I absolutely love this word. My business Renew Full Circle Consulting has the likeness of the word renew in it. So let's talk about what renew is. Renew is to resume after an interruption. I'm going to give you some simple, brief definitions. To resume after an interruption. Just reading that, everything from a cellular level is rising on the inside of me because many of you watching have had some type of interruption to transpire in your life, um, an interruption to transpire in your business where for a moment or two, it may have left a sense of uncertainty. Like, what do I do next? Should I do this next? So renew, remember, is to resume after an interruption. So this is your clue, your download, your... Um, confirmation that it's time to resume something major that you were doing prior to interruption. Here's another definition for renew. To give fresh life or strength to revive. My goodness, my gosh. To give fresh life or strength uh, or revive. Now, all of this even my website, RenewFullCircle.com, all of this has Renew in it. I actually have, I don't even know if I, I'll just hold off on that other thing. But everything is so centered around the word Renew. And at the time that I got the download, it's been over 12 years ago when I started Renew Full Circle Consulting, I had no earthly idea how the evolution of this particular brand that I'm building would evolve and be this full circle um, thing that, that I could actually touch, that you could feel from a cellular level that would 
continue to grow, evolve, and impact people in such deep and profound ways. I had absolutely no idea, but you know, God is so majestic. He is so purposeful. Um, he is the source of it all. And when we are tapped in, tuned in and connected, um, there's so many amazing things that we get throughout our time that we are, are tapped into the one true source, the one true God. And there are times where we'll get inclinations that we should do something, even when we, when we don't know the fullness of a thing. But because of our intuition, because of our discernment, because of the familiar relationship we've had with uh, the Holy Spirit and you know, God himself, the source himself, we trust that thing even when we don't know the fullness of it. And so I definitely trusted him in the download for just the name, Renew Full Circle Consulting, right? RenewFullCircle.com, my, my domain, all of it, I trusted. Um, here's another definition for Renew, to replace something broken or worn out, to replace something broken or worn out. So I'm asking you at this time, because oftentimes in the, the marketplace we hear, I'm rebranding. I'm going to rebrand. And, you know, I'm always skeptical when I hear that, especially when it's like every six months, every year. I always am skeptical because I understand that oftentimes when people have had an interruption or when people need fresh life or they need to replace something that's broken or worn out they think it's time to rebrand but branding is really a deep process it's an internal process and oftentimes they really just need to renew their brand and people will start with uh changing their logo their website or pretty pictures and none of that is your brand goodness this is a subject that i absolutely love teaching, training, talking about, and just being in the energy of because your brand is not your logos. It's not your website. It's not your pretty pictures. Your brand, you are your brand. What's occurring and happening on the inside of you, all of those things are, are making up your brand and how the marketplace sees you. That's your brand, how they are experiencing you, the energy that you are giving them. And oftentimes, let's just say, for instance, that there has been an interruption, right? Then what type of energy do you think you have been putting out into the marketplace and into the atmosphere? And so branding is very much an internal process that really is for a person who wants to have longevity, and what it is that they're building. It is a foundational space to continue to expand and, and experience reinvention and evolution and growth from, right? And so is it time for you to renew your brand? Now, I also shared that I would talk about renewing, uh, not renewing your brand. We just talked about that, but rebranding your life. So let's talk about what a brand is. So a brand is a particular identity. Oh, goodness. I love that word. <laughs> a, a brand is a particular identity. It is how people identify what it is that you do, the work that you put out into the world, the experience that they get when they connect with you. That is a particular identity. Now, I'm often talking about identity from multiple areas as I work with clients. One way in particular is um, identity shifting, right? And this is when you're deciding that the self-concept and how you've been identifying yourself, although it worked for the level that you were on, it no longer serves who you are now and who you desire to become. And so when you're wanting to rebrand your life, Remember, your brand is a particular identity. So you're, you're wanting to step into, to actualize a new identity, right? Um, a brand is something that also happens, uh, rebranding your life, rather, 
after a transition. We kind of talked about transition before, but when you're rebranding your life, maybe like myself, you went through a divorce. That's a transitional time, right? Where you may say, I need to rebrand my life or I'm ready to rebrand my life. You also may experience the desire to rebrand your life during a growth spurt. During a growth spurt. Now, if you're listening to this, I'm willing to bet that you're an ambitious woman who believes in personal growth and personal development and learning new things and becoming better and self-love and self-care, regardless of what level you're at in those particular vernaculars, I'm willing to bet those are things that you believe in. And so it's very likely that you have done some inner work at some point and you just had this major growth spurt internally. Because as within, so without. Whatever is going on on the inside will then be reflected on the outside. But during a growth spurt, it's a great time to consider rebranding your life after a deep sense of awareness. So you may have experienced a space of awareness and learned some things about yourself that you did not know or learned some things about life in general that you did not know. And now you've decided that you want to rebrand your life. You want a new quality of life. You want new experiences. You you want new love interests or you want to experience love at new levels with the husband or wife that you already have. And I say husband because my content is mainly for women, but I don't want to uh, take anything away from any men who may be listening who desire to experience love at a new level with their wife. Maybe you've dedicated your life to your children and now your children are off living their lives or you've dedicated your life to a job. Um, You've dedicated your life to running your business a particular type of way and you no longer desire to run it in that same manner, right? You're you're having um, a deep sense of awareness about wanting to do things different and you want to rebrand your life. You want to step into a new space of identity. Here are some things to consider. First, we're going to talk about renewing your brand. Here are some things to consider. Number one, it is internal. You will create the same thing over again if you don't go within to decide what needs to be renewed about your brand. Remember, renew is to resume after an interruption, to give fresh life. What needs fresh life a new strength or to be revived in your brain. You you have to go within. And oftentimes I work with a lot of um, brick and mortar uh, based businesses, uh, coaches, uh, self-employed entrepreneurs, and oftentimes working with the aesthetics, like the outside things, buying new equipment, remodeling the inside of the business, uh, new logo, website things. Often those things come to mind and yes they have their place but if you're really wanting to renew your brand it is going to happen from within that's the first thing to realize that this process is an internal process so your business has a soul right and your soul is your mind your will and your emotions when we're talking from a spiritual basis but all of those things are internal So your business has a mind, your business has a will that may be your systems and, you know, your mission and things for the business. Uh, Your business has an emotion that may very well be a part of this identity and how people experience your business. It has a soul. So you want to tap in with the soul of your business, the internal spaces of your business when it's time to renew your brand. And when it's time to rebrand your life, I want you to think from a space of identity. How do I want to see myself differently? Just two things for you to think about today. Maybe you're in a space where it's time to renew your brand. Maybe you're in a space where it's time to rebrand your life. And hearing this brings you to a new space of awareness of what you're going to do and who you're going to become in order to make those things happen. I will, I have two offers. Um, One is my 3D brand masterclass. Please stay connected. I will be 
dropping details to my 3D brand masterclass really soon. And then also my identity shifting sessions. Those are two live offers that you can message me. Um, I'll put links in the comments that are available uh, to connect with now if you're looking to renew your brand or rebrand your life peace and abundance.